Absolutely. All right, let's get over to Amber now and check in on our forecast. We got lots of celebrations going on today. Oh, and look how beautiful it is behind yeah. you and Catalina. I found another spot that's showing off the Dodger pride. Blue, this is the old casino in Catalina. So you can see this morning, we're looking at clear skies. That is why it's so cold on this Halloween morning. So here's a look at our next weather forecast, what we're watching for. The good news is that even though it's cold, we're going to slowly start to warm up, but our temperatures will remain below average, and it's going to stay quiet, at least through tomorrow. What we're really watching for right now, and I know everybody has a big plans this weekend. We're looking at that chance of rain and also mountain snow moving in, and so we could see anywhere from half an inch or more for the coast and valleys up to an inch for the mountains and maybe up to about a quarter inch to a third of an inch for some of our desert communities. I'll get to when we can expect that rain to move in coming up, but here's a look at those temperatures. So grab the jackets, grab the layers this morning, and I know there's going to be a lot of those trick or treating parades at schools. So the good news is that it's going to be a little cooler at the start. So if there if your kids costume is a little thicker, that's going to help. So 50 degrees right now for Burbank, upper 40s for Claremont, 51 for Fullerton, 54 for LAX. Our hour by hour forecast for downtown LA. You could see once we get into the second half of the day, this is where we get into the 70s, but we're well below average for this time of year. So we're going to stay well below average. And then as we head out into the evening for those trick or treating forecasts, uh, take a look. We are looking at oh, there's that which we're looking at temperatures in the mid 60s by 5 p.m. And then it just starts to get cooler as we head into the rest of the evening. So 59 by 7, 56 by the time we head into the 9 p.m. hour. I think 9 p.m. is a little late. I don't know about you guys <laughs> to do trick or treating, but sometimes we get those stragglers knocking on the door. Uh, here's a look at what's happening. There is a system to the north of us. This is why it's going to be cooler than normal this afternoon. And then our rain chance, as I mentioned, starts to really bump up as we head into the weekend. The best chance where we're likely going to see most of the rain will be on Saturday. Unfortunately, I know there's going to be a lot of events taking place Saturday. I just know that we're going to see periods of on again, off again showers. Uh, most of it, though, should be for the first part of Saturday, and then we will continue to see the showers linger into the first part of Sunday, and then we're drying up. So temperatures take go from 70s today to the 60s, and then going back up into the 70s as we head into the start of next week. All right, here's a look at your next traffic with Alex.